the two type of niggas in this world, that niggas with guns and niggas with butter. Now, what are the guns? The guns, that's the real estate. The stocks and bonds. Artwork. You know, shit that appreciates with value. What's the butter? Cars, clothes, jewelry, all that other bullshit that don't mean shit after you buy it. That's what it's all about. Guns and butter, baby. You little dumb motherfuckers. Warning. All displays of negativity will be deliciously repackaged and properly returned to sender. Only good vibes allowed beyond this point. Now if you're ready, come on in. Champagne gang, fizz fam, confidence. <laughs> Welcome to the chalet for Sip, Savor, and Spill, where we dish out all the juiciest gossip with a twist of empowerment and a dash of charm. <laughs> so listen, today we're sipping on a story from Instagram, and I'm telling you, I laugh every time I see stuff like this. I do. A man dressed like a woman, trying to tell a woman how to be a woman and not be a woman while cosplaying as a woman. Because what are we doing? <laughs> what are we doing? How can... Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Let's get into this shot of empowerment before we really get into it. Raise those glasses high. We're going old school today. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. Let's toast. So before we get into it, check out this video. You know what I really hate? Cause girls don't got the strength as niggas. They, they don't. I grew up around, I grew up around the other girls. I hate when girls be like, oh, I'm a dog. I'm a man. I, I, I'm, I act just like a nigga out here. No, y'all don't, baby. No, y'all don't. No, it's just not. It's y'all just soft. Y'all females. It's the estrogen, baby. It's not happening. You cannot move like a nigga. You cannot think like a nigga. You cannot act like a man. It's just not happening. And I want y'all to stop lying to yourself, telling yourself that y'all want these niggas to tell y'all the truth. No, y'all don't, baby. Nobody don't want to hear no motherfucking truth. And then when a nigga do start telling y'all the truth, y'all start bugging the fuck out and losing it. Which is why the reason. Which is why the nigga lies to you in the first place. And what the fuck a nigga telling me the truth for? Bitch, you're that bold. Bitch, you don't give a fuck about me that much. When I tell niggas the truth, I don't give a fuck about them. They like my little side niggas. It, 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 I'm not that invested. So here's the truth. Take it or leave. My bitch that I love, like, I'm in the field. Bitch, I'm not telling you. I'm Jody. You know what I really hate? Because girls don't got the strength as niggas. They, they don't. I grew up around, I grew up around the other girls. I hate when girls be like, oh, I'm a dog. I'm a man. I, I, I'm, I act just like a nigga out here. No, y'all don't, baby. No, y'all don't. No, it's just not. It's y'all just soft. Y'all females. It's the estrogen, baby. It's not happening. You cannot move like a nigga. You cannot think like a nigga. You cannot act like a man. It's just not happening. And I want y'all to stop lying to yourself, telling yourself that y'all want these niggas to tell y'all the truth. No, y'all don't. Baby, nobody don't want to hear no motherfucking truth. And then when a nigga do start telling y'all the truth, y'all start bugging the fuck out and losing it, which is why the reason, which is why the nigga lies to you in the first place. And what the fuck a nigga telling me the truth for? Bitch, you're that bold. Bitch, you don't give a fuck about me that much. When I tell niggas the truth, I don't give a fuck about them. They like my little side niggas. It, 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 I'm, it's, I'm not that invested. So here's the truth. Take it or leave. My bitch that I love, like, I'm in the field. Bitch, I'm not telling you. I'm Jody. You know what I really hate? Because girls don't got the strength as You know, <laughs> listen, I don't have a problem with what anyone chooses to identify as. That's your prerogative. You can identify as a man, a woman, a horse, cat, dog, or in between. That's your choice. But just because you choose to identify as a pit bull doesn't mean you can go out and challenge one because it's going to show you what you're not. So Saucy Santana made this video talking about women need to stop lying to themselves because they can't be dogs and they can't act like a ninja because girls are soft and they can't act like a man because we can't move like a man, right? All the while, he's sitting over there looking like somebody mixed up the pieces for Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head. Baby, stop. You have a man that wants to be a woman, 
trying to tell women who they are. And before y'all start with all that, he's not trying to be a woman-ish, who the hell else is he trying to be? An armadillo? A sloth? They have long nails and lashes. So is that what it is? Because what else is he trying to be? How can you consistently criticize something that you're trying to be? Everybody want to tell women who they are and what they are not. Now they want to label us to separate biological women from those who identify as such. So now that women have opened up the door with full arms of acceptance, you now want to kick women to the curb because they're your competition for what you really want. A woman, and we're not going to start with all that biological cis-ish. It doesn't matter if a woman can have babies or not. Being able to have babies does not make you a woman because there are women who can't have children. Having a reproductive system is what makes you a woman. You know, the triplets, fallopian cervix and ovaries, and their cousin, milk ducks. And of course, the mama and grandmama of it all, vagina and uterus. Yeah, you can't replicate that with a BBL or breast implants. And let me ask you a question. When you release, does it still have fishlets in it attempting to swim upstream? Riddle me this, right? Men who look like women bragging about taking a man from a woman. How is that a flex? How? A man who will leave a woman for a man was never for a woman anyway. That just means you got somebody who can't even be honest with you about who they are or what they want. How is that a flex? It's not even a flex when women do it to women. It's not. It's not. How is it a flex? How does it give you bragging rights? To know the man you're with probably had his kielbasa down another woman's nether regions and his tongue piping her fallopian tubes and then came to lay up with you with the same tongue and peen to sword fight and spearfish with you and you're okay with that that's bragging rights you don't know what that spear fished out before it came to you and you're bragging like give yourself a chance if he'll cheat with you baby he'll cheat on you so how's that a flex we so backwards. We so damn backwards. We are. We brag about stuff we should shut up about and we shut up about stuff we should be talking about. Then to turn around and say, I lie to people I care about and tell the truth to people I don't. Say what now? You shouldn't trust anybody who is quick to tell you an easy lie over a hard truth. Because in order to be close with you, I got to consistently try to figure out what you're going to be honest with me about. I can't trust a liar. And with that statement, you became liar number one on my list. And that made you somebody I cannot trust. Women can't be men because we're too soft and have estrogen. Well, men can't be women because they have a woodpecker, an apple named Adam, a prostate, and a scrotum. See, that thing has to work both ways. I don't care how much lips, hips, ass, and a cardi you may have. Baby, you're still just playing dress up. James Brown said it like this. This is a man's world, but it doesn't mean nothing without a woman or a girl. <laughs> Bottle girls, raise those glasses to being authentically you. For being queens, irreplaceable, irreproachable, irrepressible, irrefutable, and for damn sure irresistible. Nikki Giovanni said it like this. I sold diamonds in my backyard. My bowels deliver uranium. The filings from my fingernails are semi-precious jewels. On a trip north, I caught a cold and blew my nose, giving oil to the Arab world. I am so hip, even my errors are correct. I sailed west to reach east and had to round off the earth as I went. The hair from my head thinned and gold was laid across three continents. I'm so perfect, so divine, so ethereal, so surreal. I cannot be comprehended except by my permission. Ego tripping. <laughs> know your worth and don't let anybody dim your shine. Confidants, always remember, if it doesn't cause you to elevate, it's causing you to depreciate. Now raise those glasses, clink it, and let's drink. Till we meet again. Ta-ta.